During Storm Imogen about two months ago, the natural sandy elements of this beach were washed away and rocks and stones were moved right up to the top end of the beach. Unfortunately, that uh, has turned what was once a sandy beach into a pebble beach. Behind me is about 150 metres of pebbles and rocks and at the cost of about £2,000 they're all going to be moved. They're going to be taken somewhere else, not quite sure where, uh, to try and retain some of this beach's natural sand. Nigel Couton, who took over the concession at the beginning of this year, says that he's actually only making about half the money he needs to for the business to, to be sustainable. He says that nobody's coming to the beach. They come down, they look, they see the stones and then walk away. He has decided that he's going to close the cafe during the week, um, potentially putting two people out of work because it, he just can't afford to keep it open. Jersey's infrastructure minister, Deputy Eddie Noel, says that actually by the autumn this beach will probably go back to the way it was all on its own uh, with the help of nature. But he understands the, uh, the need to preserve the area for business and for tourists and so he's sending in the diggers and they're going to come and take all the stones away and put them somewhere else. I've spoken to several dog walkers this morning who described the area as a hazard, saying that someday someone's going to have an accident as they struggle to climb over the rocks.